Hello everyone, I hope you're all doing very well. Today's valued viewer request is from you, Jackie and Dan Spragans. From Jackie, next time you can make Iraq Air Force used Super Attendart attack oil tanker in Persian Gulf story. Here's one example, but it seems like a general tactic the Iraqis employed. 1984, we are in the Iran-Iraq war. One tactic used by both sides was to attack oil tankers from the opposing coalition. Now these oil tankers were often actually neutral, including British ships. And we're going to have an example of one here. June 26, 1984. A Greek tanker attacked by Iraqi warplanes in the Persian Gulf Sunday while loading Iranian oil was hit by a French-built Exocet missile that failed to explode shipping executive said today and this seems to be normal with the exosets the argentinian exoset that hit hms sheffield and did actually sink it in the end but it didn't actually explode other shipping sources said a tugboat at sea near kark island reported seeing smoke billowing from the terminal after the attack suggesting that the iraqis might also have hit oil loading installations at the terminal the tugboat was towing the turkish tanker bayuk han which was damaged in an, an attack by Iraqi planes on June 3rd. The shipping executive said that the captain of the Greek tanker, Alexander the Great, had reported that an Exocet missile smashed into the ship's number no. 5 oil tank but did not explode. At the time of the attack, the vessel was berthed at Iran's Karg Island oil terminal, the only terminal where Iran is currently able to load its oil onto tankers for shipment out of the Gulf. It is unclear whether the Exocet fired at the Alexander the Great was launched from one of the new Super Attendar jet fighters, new for 1984, that Iraq brought from France earlier this year, or from attack helicopters. The United States, Britain and West Germany all tried unsuccessfully to stop France from selling Iraq the supersonic planes, arguing that they would greatly increase the ability of President Saddam Hussein of Iraq to attack shipping in the Gulf and thus threaten the West's oil supplies. Iraq has admitted using its super attendards in several attacks on shipping in the Persian Gulf this year. Iran, meanwhile, has said it has moved more than half a million soldiers up to its front line with Iraq in what is viewed as preparation for a new summer offensive. The attack Sunday on Alexander the Great ended a two-week pause in the regular attacks from both Iraq and Iran. Both Iraq and Iran have been making against shipping in the Gulf for several months. And in this interesting document from 1990, chapter 14, The Tanker War and the Lesson of Naval Conflict, go down to page 6, which lists all of the known attacks from either side. June 24, the 152,000 tonne Greek tanker Alexander the Great, fully loaded with Iranian oil, was slightly damaged by an Iraqi missile at Kark Island. The missile penetrated the oil tank but failed to explode. Welcome to the reenactment. We are on a super secret, stealthy Iraqi base with three newly purchased super attendards. Each super attendard has two Exocet AM-39 missiles. Lead, take us out to the runway, please. Now, I'm slightly worried because this is a very small runway. We've done that to keep it on a very small stealth island. We are gonna take off and head for Kark Island, which is Iran's only place to ship oil in and out of the Persian Gulf which of course they need for the well-being of their country and we are going to kind of cut that oil supply off three rolling go flaps down guys this is going to help okay lead take us away when you're ready full burn copy holding brakes throttling up not holding brakes Good luck, boys. Good luck. Beautiful. 0.4 nautical mile runway. Set heading 4021021 magnetic to Park Island. She's twitchy. She is. Down. It's not easy to drive this thing. Mm. 
You guys see anything off our one o'clock? Got nothing at the moment, guys. I'm too busy looking at our ass, making sure not crushing too. I got nothing. Don't stare too hard. It's quite nice. Mm. They're well over the horizon, I think, guys. So we'll just keep going. Look at our beautiful new Iraqi Super Attendards, guys. What a plane this is. Apparently, Iraq leased these aircraft while waiting on some mirages to be delivered. Nothing like taking your rental to the uh, to the war. Yeah, like the rental. That's it. Thrash it. What do you do with a rental? You thrash it. That's what we do. Still no tally on Cark Island, still over the horizon, boys. But we've got to be low because otherwise, those rainy yeah, F-14s these... are going to come and do us. I can see it. You well, can see it? Yeah, the clock. How do you see it? And I don't. That's it, that's it. Uh, five degrees left lead, break formation. Going air to ground radar on. Let's try and pick up a. Yep, yep, yep. I've got a signal heading 015. I've got a blip on the radar. Locking now. Launch authorized. I've got launch authorized. I'm going to get a little bit closer there, guys. I want to make sure the sex is at hits. I got, yeah, I got tally on Alexander the Great import. I'm 40 clicks out. A little bit closer. A little bit closer. These are not the best missiles in the world. The cap oh, is Bruiser. Bruiser. I'm getting out, guys. I'll see you back at base. I'm watching and following him. It looks quite cool, actually. That's gonna hurt. Boom! Boom! Smash that tanker. Leeds Space Missiles going in. Boom! Right into the superstructure. Alexander the Great is on fire. Oh, God. Welcome back, Valid Viewers. We've transited back across the Gulf. Fuel 1500. We are very low on fuel and we are going to land. We haven't heard back whether it's a successful strike or not, but reports have come in that smoke has been seen at Cark, so we're hoping for the best. I am going to pull a little harder. Straight out. Straight out. Flaps down. Flaps down. Gear down. Gear down. Coming off the throttle. All right. Full idle. Full idle. Speed brakes out. Let's get it down, boys. Get it down. Right, get on those wheel brakes. Oh, we're not gonna. Ah, we did say it was gonna be short. <laughs> don't, 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 don't. You'll flip it. Yes, look at that. These rugged, these rugged French. Well, you always say when you've got a rental, you trash it, don't you? So, come on, let's go. In comes three. In comes three. Got a little bit lost, but he's with us now. Okay, three. As soon as you hit that threshold, get on those wheel brakes. The super stealth island is very short. Don't tell me he's going to make it. 
Don't tell me he's going to make it. Easy. Nice. Well done. Well done, boys. We've bombed Alexander the Great. I hope you enjoyed that and see you later.